Hello, I'm Nancy Hogshead Maycar, a civil rights attorney, an Olympic gold medalist, and CEO of Champion Women, a nonprofit organization. Champion Women is committed to using sport to improve the lives of girls and women. It's the connection between women's issues and athletics. Champion Women will amplify the voices of girls and women who may not be able to speak for themselves. The athletes, the coaches, the victims of sexual abuse or domestic violence, or pregnancy discrimination. You should care about these issues even if you've never done a sit-up, even if you're a single guy. Sports are very public, and the whole community gets to see how we treat boys and girls, men and women, in one of the few places that we segregate males and females. Our most powerful and influential athletic institutions are falling short in addressing critical gender equity issues. Champion Women brings together nationally known and committed experts to its board and working committees. Champion Women will engage its followers, like you, at its website, championwomen.org, as well as other organizations, to target equality, accountability, and transparency throughout sport and throughout culture. Examples of issues Champion Women will focus on include 1. Too many high schools, colleges, and universities are out of compliance with the most basic Title IX athletics requirements, even after 42 years of the law. Champion Women will mobilize local groups like yours to push for more girls and women's teams. Two. When confronted with allegations that athletes have committed sexual assault or engaged in sexual harassment, too many colleges, universities, and high schools act to protect the athlete, oftentimes creating a hostile environment for the student body. Three, collegiate sports will be restructuring in the coming years in response to the legal rulings in the Northwestern and O'Bannon cases, making advocacy for women's sports all that much more important. Girls and women need a voice in this new restructuring. Four, women's coaches face unfair and discriminatory employment conditions, particularly in the world of collegiate athletics, receiving far less pay than their male counterparts. They are locked out of the market to coach men while representing just 41% of the coaches of women's teams. In addition, we expect them to be the primary advocates for their girls and Title IX compliance. Five, the United States Olympic Committee is creating a separate non-governmental agency to investigate and sanction sexually abusing coaches, an effort that will fail if the agency does not have independence. Strong advocacy for girls and women will be necessary. Six, the United States Olympic Committee is not bound by most civil rights laws in its relationship with athletes who are neither employees nor students. This issue touches over three million athletes that operate under the Olympic Sports Act. So what do I want you to do? Number one, contact Champion Women if you have an issue involving participation, sexual harassment and abuse, pregnancy discrimination, or any issue that touches women and sports. Two, please sign up at championwomen.org. We need your voice. Three, please donate to our organization. Our success is directly related to our ability to raise funds. Four, you can also follow me on social media on Facebook or Twitter at hogshead3au. Remember, we can all be champions for women.